each rock has its own concentration of oligo elements and elements, you know. So, the, for instance, here you are in Kimmer region, uh, you know, time of Jurassic uh, uh, rock. They have their own content of manganese, ferrous, and so on. The roots are unable to, to eat this manganese, this ferrous, and so on. It is microbes who attack the rocks, and so what do the roots? The roots secrete acid. With acid, they attack the rock, they give also sugar to the microbes. The microbes transform the element of the rock, and they be, the element becomes assimilable and go inside the vine. And inside the vine, it is not, you know, it is not the manganese who gives the task of the vine, because the task of the vine is organic compound. You know, an organic compound came from the sugar, so from the sun. Yeah. But to create mas uh, malic acid, to create uh, uh, all elements who give task to the vine, you need enzyme. And what, what are enzyme? Protein with manganese or zinc or ferrous. And so, you know, it is a cofactor of the enzyme or metal, and metal comes from the rock. So if you have a, a, a big complexity of metal in your rock, you have a big complexity of enzyme in your vine, and you have a big a, a synthesis of different flavor in your vine. If you have only, you know, you put just nitrogen, potassium, phosphorus, you know, fertilizer, you have very simple wine, and you have a cépage wine. You have not a terroir wine. If you want to have your terroir wine, you need to have the complexity of micro, uh, microbiological complexity who give all the elements of the stone inside your vine, and that you have more enzyme and more flavor. And this is a terroir. This it's is a terroir. It's an explication for, for us.